Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ark the Lad Twilight of the Spirits with me, Ultra Gamer J. In our last episode, we gained quite a few useful items, and we made an unlikely ally in Bebe Dora. So with that said, let's go confront Camellia for double-crossing us. This is an all-hands-on-deck situation. Time to start making the mother of all omelets. Wait. Can you use... Would it be a good idea to use bug eggs for an omelet? I don't think so, but... Maybe? I don't know. Tentacle, eh? What's this? If, it, if this is really a tentacle, then what's it doing in a rated T for Teen game? I kid, of course. We won't be reaching M rated games, games for a while. But we will. Eventually. And since this is a boss fight. Fight. I can go nuts with the spells. Oh, I see Blizzard rage at the storm. Blizzard! Almost got up one third of its. One point shy of getting one third of its health. We'll go with the, the oldie, but the goodie. Hmm. 
Prepare to die. Nice. Sword of awakening. Watch your back. I personally would recommend just using, I don't know, you know, having the strings wrap around, around the, around what's her, what's a who's it's, Sienna's throat, throat, and just has to asphyxiate her, her with them. And, I mean, you don't have to control her body. Oh, Selkis. The name is Selkis. Yeah, just wrap it around her just wrap the strings around her throat like it's Garrett wire her, and choke her to death. That's an option. Hell, you could do that for the Coelop soldiers, too. No need to do body control. Roll and cater to someone's fetish. Because the last thing thing we need, need is someone getting off to murdering their own family. Everyone wants, all masochists want to, well, maybe, if not most masochists, want to be under, under body control. None of them want to be dead. True story. And since I can't reach it, that tentacle, probably can't control it, so, next best thing. You're missing your 10 points of HP from last time. Oh, sucks to be you. We don't need you for healing right now, but you can, can go on sniper duty as punishment. Well, as an addition to the punishment punishment of not getting getting the attack boost. Yeah, that's kind of what we were doing, Camellia. Although it makes me wonder if that... Is that tentacle? Will Selkis's butt? Things to ponder. I mean, insects have butts, so... And they don't reproduce the same way humanoids do, so... Just... Something I'll be thinking about as I try to go to sleep at night. Darn it. Can't do jack. Guess I'll move on to the next one. Oh, well, since you're...
You had that coming, Camellia. Next time? Maybe next time you'll think before backstabbing. Actually, hold on. Who wants roast tentacle? Much roasted. See how much HP this foot soldier's got. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't know if it warrants a, a blizzard, but so let's try a back attack first. Oh wow, half its HP with just one attack. Good for us. Uh, five points away from it follow actually doing what dark wanted I wonder if can't ooh we can showcase it actually it's got half its hit points left not much of a point it's already got one foot in the grave. I wonder which one of these foot soldiers is the one that passes the butter. Are you glad to face this pretty flower? <laughs> just Selkis giving just being a reiteration of that one scene from Rick and Morty where it's like The power of doing jack-all! Anyways, as I was saying, just maybe just a parody or maybe a heartfelt tribute or affectionate parody of that scene from Rick and Morty with the butter-passing robot. But it's just with the Coelopt foot soldier. Because these guys look ready to work right out of the egg. Man, holy shit, Delma killed that one easy. Well, she almost killed it. Your death is near. Let's go. Let me well, fudge Newtons. I was saving that. I wanted to save that for the for a tentacle. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, jump to the gun, jump to the gun. Let's fix that. Come on. Someone's gonna be doing matricide under our orders. Well, shit. Yes, you're very intimidating doing just standing there and not even menacingly. I mean, unless I mean, you would be if you had Kanji or Katakana coming out of you in the background. Oh, now you decide to use your ace in the hole.
Prepare yourself. Special delivery. See, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where? There you are. Was that the quell up? Did it actually use the quell up froth? I have no idea. But I'm not gonna wait and find out. I think we got it. Oh, shit. Alright, new conscription. Succeed where Camellia failed. Delma, you get in on the action, too. Oh wait, I, I I don't need to I need to close in. What was I thinking? Try this again. Mind control. Wow, for real? Two times in a row? How's that? 
Deimos only understands strength. Wow. Was it just looking at Camellia sideways or something? Is that something bugs can do? Technically, I mean, this Coelopt isn't under mind control. It's under body control. Oh yeah, so it did use that. It did use the Liquid Sphere. Wow, I've heard of abusive, abusive siblings, but this is ridiculous. Now it's time to make mommy pay for not letting us go to the One Direction concert! It was vice versa in your case, but all right. enable story right there. Die. Take this. And that is one tenacious little larva. Slippery one too. Can insects even feel embarrassment? I know fans of Pooh's adventures physically cannot experience embarrassment. It's over for you. Special delivery. That's what you get from me. Oh shit, I forgot about those spirit stones. I don't feel embarrassed so much as silly. Kinda dropped the ball on that. Although I'll try not to drop, although I should drop the ball, or in this case, coil opt liquid sphere in this scenario. Why is it whenever I'm, more often than not, whenever I'm doing my let's plays, I almost I sound eerily similar to a human drunk text. Can I use this? Nice try. 
What do we got? Nah. Too broke. Too damaged. And like any queen in a in a political society, you would have well modern political society. You would have no true power. Can we? Can we? Can? Oh yes, we can. It's no surprise to me, Selkis is her own, her own worst enemy. Hey, you, little... you should have let him go, go to the Randy Rainbow concert. Then he wouldn't have done that. Or at least we wouldn't have made him do that. Jerry, I'm hunting bugs. Yep. Last chance. It's my turn. Actually, let's see if we can do it again. Let's 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 do it again. I'm just going to assume Coelopt Society doesn't have child protective services. Although that Coelopt probably isn't technically a child. Yes, Jerry. Yes. Seems kind of redundant to tell it, tell an icy blizzard to rage like a storm and then say blizzard, but what the hell do I know? Now is Next time you're dead. true words could not be spoken. But yeah. Now is probably not a very good time to call the Department of Redundancy Department. It's over for you. Special delivery. My 
mind control. Oh, goody. Get those items. I'll take that. Boy, we are just making a killing with Coelopt froth. Or just getting our hands on it. You can't afford it. Follow my lead. Prepare to die. Sword of Awakening. Has Selkis ever, like, asked herself why the Coelopt are the guardians of the shrine? Just something to wonder. And I mean, Dark's technically wrong. Selkis still has two of her kids. They're just being forced to try and commit matricide. I believe it is in this scenario that if Bebe Dora saw that Coelopt soldier as a Toy, she would say, Aww, it's broken. How's this? <coughs> Did that feel good? Disco Inferno, baby. Take mushrooms. Baby Dora needs some healing. Wait, do I have anything better than cure? Let's see if I have anything anything better than cure. I do not. Cure it is. Soothing breeze, lend me your strength. Cure. Oh, there are so... I'm not gonna unpack that potential joke.
tenacious little thing, aren't you? Easy! You have one of its own children murder it! I'm just going to assume we just killed that soldier after killing Selkis. Since he outlived his usefulness.
And with that, I shall draw this episode to a close. This has all has been Ultra Gamer J signing off, hoping to see you all in the next video, and please remember to like and subscribe for more content.